So why study wildlife and fishery science? I think some great reasons to study this discipline. If you like the outdoors, it gets you a chance to be engaged with both fish and wildlife and their habitats. Um, if you enjoy hunting and fishing, it certainly gives you the opportunity to learn more about specific species and perhaps even hone your skills a little bit better. Uh, certainly opens up some doors as far as travel goes and seeing some pretty interesting places, places typically that the public doesn't see that are kind of off limits. And I think uh, certainly if you have uh, any interest at all in, in, in specific fish or specific wildlife species, it certainly gives you the opportunity to uh, explore and learn quite a bit more about specific things um, of those particular species. So what makes wildlife and fisheries sort of unique as a, as a discipline? Um, I got into it because I really enjoy fishing. I enjoy being outside. And I've noticed over the years that the more that I study with fish, the less of an opportunity I actually get to go fishing. Um, but I think in, in most students' cases, probably one of the, the best things about studying in this discipline um, is of course the ability to travel, uh, the ability to meet new people, um, the ability to work in an interdisciplinary fashion. Um, and I think of, of all things, you sort of learn about uh, many, many different sorts of disciplines. So I encourage students, especially uh, when they're questioning, you know, what gen ed courses should I take? I tell them, hey, you're going to have to deal with the public. So, you know, take a communications class, take a psychology class. You're going to have to deal with money. Uh, you're going to have to deal with public policy. So take a political science class, take a, a, a finance class. So I think the interdisciplinary nature for me has always been uh, rather fascinating. Uh, the fact that you have publicly held entities um, that are driven in, in large part by public interest and understanding what that public interest in is and what motivates the public, uh, I think certainly keeps the field very, very relevant. The other thing is the, the flexibility that we have. So uh, students that graduate from our program can go on for graduate school or they can walk right into the, the public sector or even the private sector uh, working for consulting firms or perhaps working in a, an entry-level position with a state or federal agency. So I think the, the flexibility of the degree is also a huge plus uh, in terms of, of studying fisheries and wildlife science. So why do I like working in fisheries and wildlife sciences? Um, for me, it's tough. Every day I, I tell my students, you know, if you don't like what you do, if you're not excited about what you do, then you're probably in the wrong field. So I like the idea that when I get up, every day is different. Um, yes, I'm a college professor, but I also wear many different hats. I'm a research scientist. I'm the president-elect of the American Fisheries Society. I have chances to speak with the public, um, both state and federal agencies, as well as private sector individuals. I had the chance to work with industry. So for me personally, um, variety has really been the key. Um, being able to integrate you know, what I know with a lot of other things, but also uh, being able to learn as I go. So the discipline changes. It's a, a very frequently changing and evolving discipline. And that also excites me, the fact that there's all kinds of new things happening. There's new discoveries happening all the time. And I really like the fact that I can be a part of that and that I can uh, hopefully contribute to the science.